Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Uh, sorry to jump right in, but <laughs> I thought that I was already recording and when I looked up, I realized I was not. All right, so I am just doing a little experimenting today. I am working on just a little four by four canvas. Um, and I'm putting on uh, just some puddles of paint. Now, I'm working with all metallics, um, just a coincidence. I didn't really um, have any set colors in mind. So what I've got here is some of the cell activator for the blooms. Now, I have um, Amsterdam Titanium White with Floetrol and I put a little bit of Minwax wood conditioner, just a couple drops. Now I'll put all of the um, info in my description as well, but I just wanted to test it to see, and um, if you saw there, I injected it, and um, I decided to use my little mini leaf blower and blow it around. I get too dizzy, so it's hard for me to blow, blow it with you know my mouth or even a straw sometimes. So now I, I figured I would just spin it and see what happens if it would open it up even more. So it, it's looking pretty cool. It's kind of looking like a butterfly so far. I'm not sure if it'll stay that way, but I am getting some kind of cool, uh, you know, of the lacing look from uh, the blooms um, that you normally get with just setting it on the top. I wanted to see if there was a difference in injecting it. Um, so far it's looking pretty cool. I'm just kind of uh, moving it around just a little bit to make sure, you know, the sides are covered a little bit. So I think that one turned out kind of cool. All right, now there's some wet results for you to uh, see. Okay guys, so I am doing a second one. I got good results with the first one, so I thought I would give it a try again. Um, same colors, and again, I will put those in the uh, description. But I know I forgot to tell you in the first one what my cell activator is, and what I use for mine is I take one teaspoon of Amsterdam Titanium White, and I mix that with two and a half to three ta uh, tablespoons of Floetrol, and I also add three to four drops of Minwax wood conditioner. I find that I get the best results from that combination. Um, so as you can see, I've injected it there, and I'm again using my mini leaf blower. I love using this thing. Um, when I first got it, I was quite surprised at how powerful that this little thing is. If you don't have one, you should get one. I do have a link to my Amazon store for that in my description. All right, so I think I'm just going to let you guys finish watching this, and I will be back in a GIF.
Okay guys, so I've got the wet results of the second one here for you. This one looks more cell-like than the first one, which had more of a lacing look to it. I know it's not the traditional bloom way, but I think it's still super cool. Okay guys, so this is painting number three. I am working on a little bit of a bigger canvas for this one. It's an 11 by 14. And I am going to be putting my colors in the cup this time and doing a flip and drag. I have added some coral. I think this is actually extreme sheen coral. Um, I wanted to brighten it up, add a little bit more uh, contrast with the colors there. And I'm putting them in the normal way. And with this one, I'm actually going to zhuzh it a bit um, or dirty, dirty it up a little, if you will. Um, so again, I'm doing a flip and drag. So now um, I'm going to just drag it along the canvas. And if you've watched any of my um, flip and drag videos, my other ones, I always have an issue. That's what always happens. But they usually turn out pretty cool. So I um, have high hopes for this one <laughs> as well. I'm trying to be optimistic optimistic. All right, so the colors so far look pretty cool. So um, with this one, of course, I do have some air bubbles I have to uh, get rid of. You don't really have to do that in the beginning, but I do sometimes just to make sure that they're, you know, they're, they're out of there. Um, so I'm just trying to stretch it out just a little bit more. And then I'm also going to be injecting with my cell activator again. I got good results with the first two, so I thought I would try. And I haven't done an injection one like this in quite a while. Um, I've done it before, but just with regular uh, white. And this again is the titanium white with the Floetrol. Um, and you can see when I'm going over that there's, they're uh, adding a little bit of um, cells are starting to pop up. And then this white right here is just my regular uh, Artist Loft Flow Acrylic White with my regular pouring medium, which is Liquitex pouring medium flow trial water and a little bit of golden GAC 800. And all the rest of my paints are mixed with my regular pouring medium as well. I know I forgot to tell you that in the um, beginning. All right, so now I'm just gonna stretch uh, everything out and I'm actually getting um, a bunch of cells are starting to uh, develop and also you can see in the areas that I injected that um, it's it's uh, creating uh, some cool um, detail there and I didn't blow this one out like I did the first two I wanted to stretch it to see um, what would happen with this one Okay, so I've got the wet results for you from this one. I got some cool stuff going on with this one. I got natural cells from the different paint densities, but I also got some cool detail from where I injected the titanium white uh, cell activator. So, so far, so good. <laughs> we'll see how this one dries. Okay guys, so here's the results of all three paintings. I'm actually really happy with um, how my experiments turned out and I'm interested in your thoughts, so leave me a comment below. Also, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do that. It's free and who doesn't love free stuff? And also, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I really appreciate it and it does actually help me out quite a bit. And share it with someone if you think they may enjoy it as well. All right, and don't forget, there's still time to enter my 10 thousand subs giveaway I'm giving away three free paintings so go check that video out and I have a lot more awesome videos for you to check out as well and I will see you in my next video